this is the um, andrology department of the embryology lab here at Bourne Hall, Cambridge. And this area here is where we prepare, receive and prepare uh, the samples um, for IVF and for IUI. And these will be freshly uh, produced partner samples or frozen donor. The majority of people here are coming for a standard IVF treatment or for IVF with the ICSI procedure where we're injecting a single sperm into a single egg. And there are certain um, uh, numerous regulations rather surrounding the, the use and control of donor sperm. So for a patient coming here, they would be reassured and guaranteed that the sperm we're using is screened for um, multiple um, sexually transmitted diseases, the family history is taken, so we, we're hoping to pick up anything unusual in the family history. Um, and not only that, the sperm is quarantined. So we are not only testing our sperm, we're keeping it for at least six months and retesting the sperm for these diseases. And that can pick up, um, for example, results that would not necessarily have been positive at the time when the donor donated. So for a fresh, this is really the main reason why fresh donation is not necessarily a good idea because there could be some um, hidden infection in there that couldn't be picked up by the blood tests. But th there is a national shortage of donated sperm and donated gametes in general to be honest so um, anything we can do to try and increase that, uh, increase that supply has, has to be good for the patients who need it.